This protocol is used for enumerating bacteria on the microscope, and we use a stain called DAPI, um, which binds to the DNA of the bacteria and it fluoresces under UV light, um, a kind of white or pale blue color. Um, so we start with samples and our samples are fixed with uh, formalin, 10% formalin, um, for a couple of different analyses. Um, but for the actual bacteria enumeration we will thaw the samples, they're stored at minus 80 so we need to thaw them and do a quick thaw so we do it in warm water. Uh, once they're thawed we um, go to the fume hood and we start doing the filtering and so we have the filter rigs um, and first we need to put on a backing filter which is 0.8 microns um, and this helps with evenness of distribution of the cells and then we use a 0.2 micron um, polycarbonate filter for the bacteria and um, the bacteria stick on top of the polycarbonate filter. Um, in order to see the bacteria on the microscope we need to first uh, stain the filter with a carpet stain called Ergolon Black um, and we stain for about 15 minutes to overnight to make it kind of this grey colour and then we can then use the filter we put the filter on the towers and then we um, clamp the tower to the base and we filter anywhere from 3 to 40 mils of seawater depending on where it's from. So for instance, inshore, inshore in Bermuda we usually do 3 mils, um, offshore deep in the ocean we'll do 40 mils. We filter the bacteria through and then we add one mil of a five nanogram per microliter DAPI solution onto the filter and we let it stain for three minutes. Uh, once the three minutes is up, we drain the, the DAPI stain through and we then mount the filter. Usually while we're waiting for the water to filter, we will label up the slides and get them ready and uh, we, met, we mount the actual filter onto the slide using high viscosity oil um, and then a cover slip um, before we go to the microscope. And then once on the microscope, uh, we do manual counts using a grid in one of the eyepieces and we count how many bacteria there are. We can also do image analysis and get the software to do some counting for us as well.